Hello there everybody, this is Brian with BSNTech.com. Today I'm going to show you how to save radish seeds from some of your radish plants. Now I had kept one radish plant to uh, come from the spring and it's doing very well. Actually I have already harvested some of the seeds off of it and I'm in the process of opening each of those seed pods and getting the seeds from them. It makes a nice way to get the seeds from your own vegetables without having to go and purchase the seeds themselves. Now it definitely doesn't save you any time because it's very tedious to pull open these pods and get only two to six, seven seeds out of each of the pods. But it will save you two or three dollars from purchasing the seed packets. So I'm going to go ahead and show you now what one of the radish plants look like. This radish plant is probably five or six months old now and like I said I've already taken off a pretty big stem from it but there are still some flowers growing on it so let's go ahead and take a look at it alright you can see here this is one of the radish plants um, I only kept one radish plant for taking seeds from it because this will produce hundreds of seeds by itself as you can see up here there was a stem that I'd already removed and I already took off several hundred seed pods from this radish plant. Overall this plant grew to be about three feet tall. You can see where it starts way down here and then it grows this long stem and then from here it's grown all of this. Now you can see all the flowers on here. The flowers are where the seed pods will come from and down here you can see some of those seed pods. These seed pods will eventually turn brown and when they turn brown they are ready to be picked. So you can see some seed pods here and then there are some way over here as well. Now since I said previously that I had collected some of these, I did and I'm going to show you now what those look like. Here are some of those seed pods that I have already taken off. You can see how all of the limbs and the stems here are completely all dried and dead and then these are the seed pods again they are also brown and dried as well so these are ready to be picked so all you do is you just take each individual of these seed pods and you'll just break it off just like that and then you can see how there is one of the pods now again there's hundreds of these on one plant so just saving one plant is probably all you need and then eventually what you'll do is you can just take your fingers and crack right down the middle here I didn't do it very well but deep in there it's really hard to see but there is a seed cameras not doing a very good job of it but there is one seed in there it doesn't look like there's any other ones at this moment so you just crack it open and there is one seed. Again, this camera is very blurry. It's not a very good camera, but it's what I have for making videos. So out of that pod, there's probably one or two more seeds, but for this video, I'm just going to show you how to do that. Actually, here's another one right there. There's another seed. So there are, there's two seeds right there. So that is how to save seed from a radish plant. 